Hi guys. Well, it is uh, August the 18th, 2024, and it is 9.55 a.m. I promised Gabriel that I would make this uh, short video in honor of his friend that they called Rogers. You remember recently because of your um, generosity in donations that Gabriel could help more people and so they had a car available to them to drive to a village where they were able to bless the 11 families with the 10 kilograms of maize flour and the uh, the soap and the matches. Total surprise for the, the people at the village. Well, it was um, his friend who made the car available for them. They called him Rogers when he passed away on uh, Wednesday. Uh, some two weeks ago now, he had uh, been driving the vehicle and ran into a cow that was crossing the road. The cow was dead immediately, the car wrecked. But Rogers took the steering wheel into his chest and that caused blood clots. So Gabriel had been off air and in the hospital nursing Rogers for those 13 days. So we'll go over to um, Gabriel's messenger and uh, this is the friend, he says, who took us to the village where we gave the 10 kilograms of food per family. I don't recall well, but I once spoke that his wife lost the child a few weeks ago. When I came to know Brighton's situation, he was so supportive where we couldn't go by motorbike. He could get the car from his uncle and then reach far distances. And now he is no more. His name was Rogers. He's such a cool person who liked to joke, who liked jokes all the time. Can I say brave? So in memory and honor of Rogers and his good works, well done Rogers. And of course, here is Brighton, who is um, not showing the scars any longer of the burns he suffered earlier in the year from the hot milk. And here's the vehicle that, yes, did kill the cow, but now Rogers, having passed on Wednesday, I believe, well, that's when I got the message from Gabriel. So just a brief video and I trust that uh, each of you who are able are uh, creating your garden of Eden in the space that you have wherever you are. I've been working at the spot by the lake and uh, yeah, I'll do a bit of an upload when I've got it the way I wanted. But it certainly keeps the mind. I, I, I read something uh, recently on one of these gardening videos that I've been watching and it's turn off the news and go to the garden and uh, it is a physiological fact that when you get your um, hands into the soil it actually yes we know about earthing when we're, we're walking barefoot on on the ground etc but getting your hands into soil uh, serotonin, endorphins, just the body completely relaxes and takes on joy, naturally, quietly. So that's what I've been doing. I'll talk to you later. Bye.